Hi everyone! So I'm just going to quickly go over a few of my recent favorite products and purchases lately. So yeah, there's only a few here, but you know these videos tend to be long. So, <laughs> so I'm going to go over a product that I've already talked about a few times and I'm kind of obsessed with, but whatever. It's the Lancome Vision Air Blur. This stuff is just amazing. I can't express it enough. Not only is it a, a wonderful primer, but it also um, helps perfect your face. So it helps like with your pores, it helps with acne, it helps with everything because the original Vision Air does all that wonderful stuff and now it's this in a primer. And so it goes in and it just fills in all your pores and it is just absolutely wonderful. I am in love with it. I, like, I'm almost empty with this thing already and I've only had it for like a month, maybe two. And I keep going to the Lancome counter. I'm like, do you guys have a big bottle in yet? Like, I want a bigger one. I want to use it forever. Like, this stuff is amazing. Like, just get it in a big jar for me. I don't even care. Absolutely in love with it. Um, also, if you are at, like, if you have a Macy's nearby, they are having a gift with purchase right now. And so you can get one of those. And then you can get a nifty gift with purchase bag. And so it has a bunch of fun stuff in it. Too. So I would suggest doing that just because it is a little bit pricier, but it is absolutely amazing. And if you don't use as much as I do, it will last you a lot longer. Um, also from Lancome, I have a Rouge and Love lip stick. Um, it is in the number 128. It's this corally, it's like a corally pink. When I first grabbed it, I thought it was going to be super, super like orange because I really wanted a nice orange color but it's actually more pink than orange. It is just gorgeous. Like when my friend showed me this, I was like <gasps> to die for. Cuz my my best friend works at the Lancome counter. That's uh I, okay, moving on. Also, I have been in love with this Milani um lipstick in the color Vol Violet Volt, sorry. And it's the number 34. And it is just mm, it's just it's not like, whoa, too much purple, but it's a nice color purple. I feel like it's an almost wearable purple on most people. You might not be super outside of the lines to want to try it, but it's pretty nice. Moving on, I have two lip balms that I have only been using for like a week or a couple days, and I'm already absolutely in love with them, so whatever. This is the Course um, Lip Balm, Lip Butter. Ugh. This stuff is just wonderful. When you put your finger in it, it's like bouncy. Like I like can push down and I feel like it's like hmm and like so you just know it's just gonna soak up everything on your lips. And then also it's this um, lip balm from Absolute New York. I think that's it. I don't know. I got it in my Epsi bag and it's called You're the Bomb and it's in the color. It's in the flavor of green apple. I don't usually like green apple. But I've liked it, and it has a little bit of tint, same with the coarse one, so you don't have to worry about, like, a lipstick. If you're in a rush, it's perfect. Fireworks are going off outside, apparently. That's cool. And then eyeliner-wise, I have been in love with this eyeliner from Jessie's Girl. This, I have a few products that I'll tell you where I got them in a second. Um, it's a, like, felt tip type liner. Ugh. And it just glides on so easily, and you can, like, shake it in case of, like, running out or something like that. It's just magical. I've been absolutely in love with it, because I feel like most liners, you can't, like, use the top of it. But, like, I can, like, go in and just use the top of it and the side of it. Ugh, I've been absolutely in love with it. So, again, that's the Jessie's Girl Liquid Eyeliner. And I've been, I've newly found um, the Tarte Mascara. I've loved it. I have another one over there. I don't, I think, I don't remember what it's called. But this one's gifted. Ugh. It's, they're just so lovely. Like, the formula is just, like, absolutely wonderful. It's not too wet and it's not too dry. Like, it's, like, a great in-between. And they seem super buildable. I've been in love. And I think that the gifted one is the one that I used to, like, thicken it. I don't know. But it's been amazing. <laughs> I recently bought the Clinique. Um, cheek Pop and Ginger Pop. I have three out of the four, so I should have to buy one more. And this one's been absolutely amazing. I'm wearing it right now. 
Um, you can wear it as like a blush or you can wear it as a bronzer almost. So it's really nice to like blend in for the two of them. I've been in love with it. Let's see if I can give you a nice little, little swatch for it. So that's the color right there. It's like a, it's a very nice like rosy, bronzy glow. Been in love to die for it. I've recently fallen in love with the color tattoo metal. Um, this is the barely branded, and it's like the um, it's like the creamy kind. I'm thinking that's what the metal kind is, but it's like a nice, it's like a nice white sh like champagne -y color, and it's just lovely. I've been using that as like a base for my other colors or I've been using it in the morning if I don't have time to do a whole bunch of stuff I just throw that on and then throw on like a nice like matte color in the crease and it's just been lovely and again that's the um, color metal 24 hour and this one the barely branded perfection um, this is another lip tar and this is actually the lip tar slash metallic Stuff, and this is the um, Black Metal Delilah. Um, I think it's just called Black Delilah, the regular color. It's this, like, gorgeous, like, super deep red, like, vampire-looking red. And I really wanted it, and I was like, ugh, I don't know if I'm going to wear it all the time. Like, I should probably just buy another color that I know I'm going to wear all the time, like a nude or a pink, which I already have a whole bunch of. And then I saw this, and I was like, um, what's this? Like, why don't I have this in my life? I put it on my hand, and my friends were like, that's perfect. Like, you need to buy it. Ugh. So it's like a, it has, like, glitter in it, and then it's also, like, a purpley, like, magenta red color. It's just lovely. And it has, like, a lot of, like, it's not glitter, but it's, like, shimmer, so it looks, like, metallic on your lips. Like, I'm guessing that's why it's called metallic. Maybe. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> it's just fantastic. Moving on, I have been using this for quite a while. It's the Eva NYC, is that what it's called? I don't know. And it's the leave-in cream, so it's like a leave-in conditioner, and you use it after the shower, before your hair gets dry, and you just, like, run it through. And it just makes my hair, once I'm able to brush it out after it's dry, like, super soft and silky and then once I blow dry my hair it's just still like super smooth absolutely in love makes my hair ridiculously soft like nobody's business <laughs> and then this is the um first aid beauty and this is the facial cleanser with fab antioxidant boosters I've heard a lot about this um I've never tried it because I was like meh I'm, like, such a Clinique girl that I just never wanted to try something else. But I've been using that every, like, once in a while just to kind of, like, shake up my routine. And it's been working really well. Like, nothing horrible. It does help dry out my face, which, if you have a dry face, might not want it. But I heard that it's, like, made of super good products, like, nothing bad type of a thing. So, liked it so far. And then this, I bought this today. I haven't tried them, so I don't know how they feel. They're just lip smackers, but not your average lip smackers. They're still in the box. I don't want to, like, here, let's see. They are flipping Disney villain lip smackers. Ah, they're so cute. And so it has um, Cruella de Vil. It has Ursula. It has, like, Queen of Hearts. It has, like, good sum of the Disney villains. And I'm just... I got it at um, Clinique. They are, it's, I think it's like ten fifty, but it's just lovely. And like I said, they're lip smackers, so they're not like perfect for your lips, but they do make them feel better and they give them a little bit of shine. But just the fun fact that they're Disney villains just like made me so happy. So I was like, buying. Anyways, and so I got um, I got these two, and the Jessie's Girl eyeliner from Ipsy. So definitely check them out. They're wonderful. I love them. Um, their products are normally pretty big size. I mean, like, this is full size, this is full size, and this is, like, it might be full size. You might be able to buy that. I don't know. But, I mean, they're pretty good size. They're pretty generous. Absolutely in love with them. Um, this, the little tester of the 
First Aid Beauty face wash. I got it from Sephora. If you spent like $35, you got like this big bag full of like all these fun goodies that was in it. A whole bunch of other stuff. I don't even remember. Ooh, I got a frog in my throat. It's been just to die for. I love every single thing in there. Um, if you ever see anywhere that's having like gift with purchase bags or like if you spend $19, you get that same gift with purchase type of a thing. It's totally worth it because you get at least a good amount of products for the price, but you get to try everything, which is always fun because then you don't have to go and buy a giant size bottle of it. That's also why I love subscription bags because you get to try everything and like Ipsy's only $10 a month, so that's not bad. And you get a little bit of a fix for your makeup problems and you get to try a whole bunch of new products, which is just lovely. So definitely check that stuff out and like Metroid stuff is just like my favorite. I can't, I can't even handle. So perfect. So yeah, um, I hope you like this video. Um, click like down below. Leave me comments. Any type of like suggestions or if you like any of these products or if there's any products you think I should try, let me know. Always wanting to buy new stuff because I have a shopping problem. Totally. And if you want to see how I got this easy, simple look, I have another video, and I'll link it or something down below. Yeah. So have a wonderful night, day, wherever you are. Thanks for watching. Bye.